Welcome to the instructions project video on how to use Pandora.com. The first step you need to do is turn on your computer. Once your computer is on, click on your internet icon. The third step, go to your web browser and type in www.pandora.com and then click enter on your keyboard. Before moving on to Pandora Radio Station, make sure you have an email in order to register on the site. If you don't have an email, create one before moving on to step 5. Then on the top right corner of the Pandora website, click on register. In order to register for the website, you need to fill out the information required. Your email address, password, year you were born, zip code, and gender. Next, make sure you click the Terms of Use and Privacy Policy box to complete your registration, and then click Register. Once registered, click on the Continue button on the page that pops out saying, Congratulations, you are now registered with Pandora. Right after an advertisement pop-up will appear, just click No Thanks. Then enter an artist, song, genre, or composer to create a station, for example, like Little Wayne. Once you have completed step 10, you are ready to listen to music. Pandora will create a station that will start playing under the artist, song, genre, or composer that you typed in. This station will also give you other music similar to what you typed in. If you don't like the song given, then you can click on the next button, which is on the top next to the play button. This will go on to another song that is similar to your station. But remember that you can only skip six times for all the stations. After that, you have to wait an hour to skip, or you can create a new station, which is the next step. If you really enjoy a song on that station, you can go to the top left where it says new station and type in the artist, song, genre, or composer that you did in step 10. So this makes it easier when you log in, your station will pop up on the left side and you don't have to retype it in. With multiple stations, you can click on the shuffle button, which is located below the now playing. The shuffle button will put all your stations together and play the songs randomly. While listening to a song, if you don't like it, then there's a thumbs up and thumbs down button located at the top to the left of the play button. If you push thumbs up, this will save that song, artist, genre, or composer and play it later in your station and it will find you another song similar to the one you gave a thumbs up to. If you push thumbs down, then the song will continue to play, but will be removed from your station and will not be played again. Next to the name of the artist on the song playing is the share and buy button. The share button, you can share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. With the buy button, you're allowed to buy the song on iTunes, Amazon MP3, or buy the CD on Amazon. One cool feature on Pandora is that you can create your own profile on the site. The My Profile button is located to the right of where it says Now Playing and Music Keys. My Profile allows you to share your music with your friends as well as look at other people's profiles and see their activity on the site. So now you're able to listen to Pandora anywhere. For example, working out, at school, at work, or driving home. Now you can enjoy listening to free music on Pandora.com. Enjoy!